What's up guys, Rhino here and welcome to another Destiny 2 video. The topic for today is Glimmer. We're going to show you the fastest way to reach the cap and make some suggestions on what items to buy. Whether you're new to the game or you're a veteran, we hope this video helps you out. So without further ado, let's get right into it. It seems that Glimmer reaches its cap pretty quickly, but it's not clear on what to spend it on. Early on, it's useful to buy gear sold by the vendors in the game, but before you know it, you'll ask go anything they sell. So what do you spend it on? How you spend it really depends on where you are in the game, but ultimately it comes down to two options. Either way, Glimmer has a hard cap of 99,999, and you won't get any Glimmer from anything you do once you hit it. So before you hit level 20, items from the vendors on each planet will sell gear up to light level 200. Generally through the campaign, their gear will be a few light levels above your own. So we suggest using this as your base. So after level 20 or reaching a power level of 200, we suggest buying random weapon mods from the gunsmith. You can no longer buy gear from vendors that is above your own, but Glimmer can still help raise your power right level. You out, Once you hit a power back. level of 280, you'll be able to turn blue weapon mods into legendary purple ones, and those add plus 5 power to the weapons or armor you add them onto. So what else can you spend your Glimmer on? There are two main end game things you can spend your Glimmer on. So the first is attaching those legendary mods that you've bought for 5,000 Glimmer at a time. Those bump up the power level of your items and lets you grind for the next power level up a little easier. And the second is purchasing treasure maps and scout reports from Cage 6, which can lead you to more Glimmer as well as a variety of other rewards including high powered loot. So how do you earn Glimmer in Destiny 2? The best method we've found is grinding out public events on a planet of your choice. In a public event, you'll earn around 10 Glimmer for every enemy defeated. You also get 120 Glimmer for defeating the many bosses in public events. That's upward of 700 Glimmer as a direct reward for most public events. Keep in mind that heroic events have the potential to drop more Glimmer per enemy defeated. Clearing out random mods will help those numbers pick up. On top of that, you also earn a few engrams along the way. Dismantling blue items also give you 100 glimmer a pop. Things will add up. So killing the general enemies in a public event, let's say you kill 50 enemies at 10 glimmer apiece, then one public event mini boss around 120, then receive 750 glimmer for competing the heroic public event. That's already 1300 to 1400 glimmer. Also dismantle two blue items each time, that's another 200 glimmer. And keep in mind, this is around 10 minutes of playtime. If you follow these steps, you could be getting 10,000 glimmer an hour. So the best thing to do is grind out public events, dump your glimmer into random blue weapon modifiers at the gunsmith, and repeat. It's as simple as that. So I hope this video was helpful. Drop us a comment in the comment section below and let us know how you spend your glimmer. Don't forget to like and share this video. If you are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Once we hit our goal of 400 subs, we are giving away custom made Havoc Gods merchandise to 3 random subscribers. You can check out the merchandise on our Instagram page, link is on the screen and also in the description below. This is Rhino with Havoc Gods and I'll catch you on the next one.